In this video, I'm going to show you the size of Grey Hamster. For those of you who've never heard it before, it's a lot bigger than you think. This number is defined as the biggest number used in a mathematical equation. But how big is it exactly? It's basically a bunch of threes multiplied out. Let's have three, arrow three. That's just the same as saying three to the power of three. Three to the power of three, that's equal to three times three times three, which is equal to 27. Now let's have three, double arrow three. Three double arrow three can also be written like this. 3 double arrow 3 is equal to 3 arrow 3 arrow 3. 3 to the power of 3, that's equal to 27. 3 to the power of 27, that's 7.6 trillion. What about 3 triple arrow 3? That's equal to 3 double arrow three, double arrow three. Three, double arrow three, as we've known earlier, is equal to 7.6 trillion. Three, double arrow 7.6 trillion. Three, arrow three, arrow three, arrow three, arrow three, 7.6 trillion times. And finally, we have three, four arrows, three. That's equal to three, triple arrow, three, triple arrow, three. Three, triple arrow, three. That's three to the power of three, 7.6 trillion times. Three, triple arrow this giant number, how that look like? Because we have three arrows in our operation, we do the repeated two arrows. And how many times do we do it? This gigantic number of times. Let's evaluate them, shall we? Three, double arrow three, as we've known earlier, is equal to 7.6 trillion. Three, double arrow 7.6 trillion. You keep iterating these power towers three, triple arrow three times. Three, four arrows, three, is also known as G1. And then, we have G2. That's equal to three, but with how many arrows to three? It has G1 number of arrows, or this many arrows. G3 has G2 number of arrows. G4 has G3 number of arrows. You keep incrementing all the way to G64, which is 3 with G63 arrows to 3. G64 is Graham's number.